Top of the morning to ya! Yo, turn it up! I kind of briefly touched on this yesterday, but uh, I got a call yesterday and they needed somebody to come uh, act like a doctor and like dress up in a white lab coat and take a picture or several pictures so I'm going to go play a doctor right now it's kind of weird I don't know it's for just advertising obviously you know so uh, basically I'm probably just going to be sitting there acting like I'm sitting behind my desk in a white lab coat and, uh, and or acting like I'm doing dental work on somebody or something so we'll see how it all turns out but should be pretty interesting doesn't it feel good just to get up I was thinking about that yesterday after Katie got off the treadmill I was like you know We've all kind of been stressed out just with behind the scenes life stuff going on that we necessarily can't mention in the vlogs uh, just because we one don't want to and two we just have a lot of other uh, priorities going on or trying to take place in our life and uh, I just was thinking that her running on the treadmill yesterday probably really felt really good when she got off. It's just one of those de-stressing things like you dread thinking about it like I was dreading thinking about it when she was doing it. I was like oh, I don't know how she's doing that but then she got off and she was just in a better mood and just you know it's just one of those things like getting up early you just feel good you're like wow there's actually this many people up and awake right now Jesus he's a rambling man you want to hear the most annoying sound in the world it's the weekend who's excited let's have a party I would close my eyes and have a dance party right now, but I'm driving and said that probably wouldn't be the most safe idea. If everybody's got good, happy plans for the weekend and y'all are gonna do something fun, there's just been a lot of kind of just crazy things and uncertainty and it's kind of like one of those things where all this uncertain, um, unplannable stuff is all going on all at the same time and being the planner that I am, I like to plan things out and have them organized and situated and and now some of you who know me would probably say like, why do you do things at the last minute all the time? But I like to know what's happening. Even if I haven't like got the plan 100% figured out, I like to know what's gonna happen and know that it's gonna happen. I may not have all the details worked out, but everything's gonna be okay. Kind of like with Cullen's job right now, it's like, I have no idea. If somebody were to tell me like, okay, he's gonna have a job and it's gonna be fine, then I wouldn't worry as much about it. And I would be like, okay, well that's fine. We'll get it figured out. It's just all kind of up in the air. And then with my licensing stuff, and then of course um, something that we haven't really talked about. So I mean, Cullen, I guess can decide to put this in here if he wants to. We've kind of talked about talking about it, and we just haven't. But I mean, I think it's one of those things we haven't talked about just because we haven't. But I think it's kind of a known fact and things. Um, but for those of y'all that are new or haven't been watching for a while, you may not know that we. Um, got pregnant in January and then lost our baby in February so that was very sad and very hard on us and um, you know we've been dealing with it as best we can but then obviously I guess it's kind of just something I figured everybody knows that we would be trying to have another baby and that hasn't happened yet so the very first time that we got pregnant it happened like immediately like the first month so this time we're learning a little bit more patience and um, that you know it's not been as easy as it was the first time as much as there's all these crazy people that get pregnant all the time you think it just would just like woo that just happens but it just doesn't sometimes so um, anyways that's just another thing that's kind of been stressful um, any of y'all who have been through that know that that can be stressful on you just when you want something really bad and then you can't have it and you can't exactly I mean you can plan for for it but you can't know for sure if if something's gonna happen so definitely a learning experience for us um, I know especially for me liking to be in control of everything and have everything go my way I've had to learn a lot to trust in God and his plan because I know that he always has plans better than I do like every single situation in the past when things have not turned out the way that I've wanted them to it's ended up that they've turned out even better and I've been like God, I'm glad it didn't turn out the way that I had planned it because God always has better plans you know it's really easy for us to get on here and talk about the happy things and like oh life is wonderful and we're so thankful and God is so good and I think you know we have to remember in these situations where things aren't going our way I mean loss of job 
crazy stressful licensing exam that I don't really know if I passed so that could affect my job and then you know wanting to have a baby and that not happening we have to remember to say in those situations too God is good in this situation as well and we have to try to stay positive which is really hard sometimes when you're disappointed and things aren't going the way you want them to to just stay positive and like oh it's happy everything's fine while I do believe truly wholeheartedly that God has better plans and everything does happen when it's supposed to and it will all happen at the right time in those moments of disappointment it's still like oh, seriously like is God listening to me is this like hello can you hear me do I need to get your email address and send you a direct message <laughs> I just wanted to share that with y'all I've been meaning to talk about it for a while and it just never comes out so there you go <laughs> Dr. Cullen is done with his photo shoot. That was pretty fun. Like, we got to go into this dentist orthodontic office that was like, nobody was working today because it's Friday and orthodontists typically don't work on Fridays. And so it was just like this empty office with all these orthodontic supplies and chairs. And I was able to like move the chair up and down. And I had to act like I was uh, talking to the assistant and the patient laid in the chair. It was fun. I see a, I see a, I see a, I see a big red ball. But you know what we have to do? You can't just look at it, you gotta touch it. Oh yeah, they gave me a free Starbucks gift card for my troubles, so I'm here to get some Starbucks. Can you roll? Oh, good girl, get your suntan on. Get your suntan on, that belly needs some sun, girl. She's like, thanks, Dad. Thanks for laying out my Burberry blanket so I can sunbathe. Let me say, hey guys, look, I can do this. Oh look, y'all are twinsies. Y'all, I just spent the time and cleaned up the counter and kitchen and everything, just trying to get everything picked up a little bit. And the salt was sitting right here on the counter. And I went to go move it back to my freshly clean stove top. And look what happened. Freaking A. Like, seriously, did somebody play a trick on me? Like, why is this loose? And why did it come unscrewed? That's ridiculous, yo! I was like, that was my final thing. Just put the salt and pepper back on the stove and get out of here. And let's go vacuum the rest of the house. But no! No! Just three snaps in the Z formation. No! There's a professional diver himself. Look at his new kicks. Where'd you get those? Those are lock laces. You just lock them up. Did you have fun at dive practice the other night? Yes. Did you? Was it fun jumping off a real diving board? We wore the same shirt. Like the and Madeline's. <laughs> no. I didn't even see you. What's we, up, girl? We keep coming out. Hey, Moody. There's more. Yeah. Whoa, we're like a we're like a clown car. This is our daughter tonight. She matches our outfit. What in the world? See? Yeah, look at her outfit. Go get mommy. Go get mommy. Look at these shoes. Do you them? Are those your mom's? Uh-uh, you're wearing your mom's yeah. shoes. Oh my goodness, you're so oh my big gosh, and you're your lip gloss and everything. In two days. Look at this, we got some live music. We, I paid them like 50 bucks to come over here. I said, we're, we're going out to eat. I need you to come play for us. He said, cool man, I'll be there at 6.30. We got Moogie over here. Woohoo! Eating that meat, girl. <laughs> Emily, what do you do when I turn <laughs> Remember last time you heard it? <laughs> that looks like Louisiana. If you look at it, and that looks like Arkansas. Oh, it does. Wait, no, that doesn't. That looks no, like, like Illinois. 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 Definitely. Like, look. All right, it. who's this? This is Florida. <laughs> no, that's not. That's California. Turn it that way. Oh yeah, that's there you California. go. California. Let's see what this one looks like. That kind of just looks like a kidney. <laughs> The man. Okay, there you go. All right, let's see what this looks like. That one looks like. Oh, what's the New state? Hampshire. No, what's New the Hampshire. state that goes like this? New Hampshire. Is it New Hampshire or New York? New York. Oh, it's or Maine? It's Maine. That looks like a C. A C? Oh, like the letter C. Uh, yeah, you can have it. Eat it. <laughs> <laughs> she's like, oh, you got me on camera. Oh, she lost her bow. Oh, it's dramatic. Oh, but it's going to fix it. Don't worry. Don't worry. He's, he's like, I got it, sister. I'll fix your hair. I'll fix it for you. I'll fix it. Let me just fix it for you. Hang on. Hang on. This is perfect. Let me just see. No, brother. I'll get mommy to do it. Let mommy fix that bow. Oh, yeah. Whoa! 
There's green. our cicada. You see him? Yeah, he's green. He's you see him? He's actually moving. I know he's alive. I'm holding it. I don't want to hold no, it. No, look. It's okay. He doesn't bite. I promise. I'm holding him. Oh, oh gosh. He feels so gross. Your, girlfriend, you your girlfriends will be proud. Did you feel it, Mama? No. Here, touch ah! him. Just, I'll hold him. You touch him. Just him. touch him. Just pet him. He won't bite. <laughs> I don't want Just pet him. I don't him. want to. You don't want to pet him? Dude, get the thing away. <laughs> You want me to put him in your sandwich? I want to put him in your sandwich. <laughs> Toy. Look at his legs. He's freaking out. Don't you dare put it on. <laughs> Take it off. I don't want it to fly away. We'll touch it first. Pet it. Keep it in your house. <laughs> Keep it in your house. No. You sure you don't want to pet it? Just touch it. No, 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 no. Okay, let's put it right here and see if it goes away. Bye, buddy. All right, guys. This is uh, 4th of July, after July, in August. We're about to smoke these We cigars. got these new cigars. They're huge. They're called the Bazooka Cigars. They make noise when they shoot. Yep. Do you want to do a crunk kitchen? We need to, yeah. I need some scallops for that. <laughs> Can you do it? Yeah. Oh, isn't that sweet? Y'all are lighting each other's fires. I don't know if these are even gonna work. Oh dear, y'all don't even know what's you're, going you're like, Don't oh. point those at your faces. Hang on, we gotta make sure they It's work. okay, it'll be on YouTube. We'll get lots of views. Sorry, <laughs> Why aren't they lighting? Oh, that's so sweet. Yeah. Oh, whoa, 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 there, yours, yours is lit, yours is lit. Hold it out, Jay, neighbor's yard. Oh, dang it. Colin, <laughs> they weren't supposed to be the ones that make noise. Wow. <laughs> Colin. Katie, give me the other lighter. Give me the other lighter. No. No, I will not. <laughs> Mine's not lit. Really. <laughs> so embarrassing. <laughs> Colin, the neighbors are going to come outside. Well, they shouldn't. Please don't light yours. I need to light one. Where's mine? I gotta do it it's all Jay's fault. It's my brother-in-law's fault. Where's the blue lighter? No, Colin, you really don't. It's right there. Colin, they weren't supposed to make noise. You don't need to. Colin. This is our neighbor's next door. <laughs> Emily, it wasn't us. We weren't making the gunshot noises. It's okay, baby. Crystal is my girlfriend, by the way. Get off your girlfriend. What? This is actually my dinner. It is at 11.30. Guys, you know it's been a fun night. When you come home with this. And you're watching Golden Girls. <laughs> yeah, and you got. Whoa. What? How I'm we do really it? I'm really trying not to eat any of them. But I should might eat one. Oh, I forgot. I'm sorry. Well, it's after midnight, so it's really tomorrow. Yep. Oh. Right off the new day. <laughs> Look at all these guys. And actually, you already blew it tonight anyway, so it's all right, so we But I only went over a little bit. Chick crystal. Crystal Ooh. chick. You just ate one. No, I ate a regular one. Mmm, those fries. I never we should have got, tonight. I was we should have gotten 24, but mm. we only got 12. Should we get some, does anybody need ketchup and mustard? No, no. that's only you. How about nope. water? Nope. Nope. Amy Van Dyke, don't judge me. <laughs> <laughs> that was Amy Van Dyke, don't judge me. Mmm. Mm. Mm -hmm. You got the chick, didn't you? Mm -hmm. It's good, isn't it? Finger licking. Mmm. Wow. How is it, Moogie? That's Love Jamaican, it. girl. How is it, it's Jamaican? Like ice. Mm hmm. Hey, my eyes sit. Sit. Good girl. Oh, so good.